commonly asked questions regarding living trusts, one would be, do I need to establish a, a living trust? Well, first of all, I do want to disclose that I'm not an attorney. I cannot give le legal advice. Um, but, you know, for informational purposes as a registered LDA, if you have assets that you want protected once you pass away to avoid the probate process, then absolutely it is necessary um, or highly recommended that you get one. Um, a living trust uh, is necessary to avoid the probate process in most cases. Um, it's most commonly used uh, to avoid the probate process, which is a revocable living trust. Uh, and those common documents would be revocable living trust, uh, trust certification, trust declaration, pour over will, health care directive, and power of attorney. Um, which is in most living trust estate plans. Uh, we do use a, a professional software that's only available uh, to legal professionals, such as registered LDAs um, or attorneys. And um, it's constantly um, being uh, revised with the most recent California law, so on and so forth, including all of that language in there. And it's very important, too, that um, you do hire a registered legal document assistant or an attorney to prepare your revocable living trust package. A lot of times do it yourself type of, uh, online forms. Um, we've actually had instances where we've assisted clients with probates because we also do probates here at, at our office simply because, um, the decedent did their do it their self living trust and you know it's not done uh correctly in order to avoid probate and so um that's why it's always highly recommended that you do hire a registered legal document or an assistant or an attorney to prepare those documents for you